Hey, what's up guys? My name is Danny. Welcome back with another beautiful video. In this video, I have another two weeks to share it with you guys. With that being said, let's get started. Okay, so the first week that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys which is gonna be the cold CC vertical. And what is that gonna be do for your control center? It's gonna be customize some stuff under the settings. And I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can customize some stuff and what you should do in order to make your control center looks like this. Okay, so under the settings here, you guys can see right now we have a couple of toggles here that you can enable or disable the way you like. So the first one, if you enable it, is going to be enable the most toggles button on your control center. And then the second one is going to be disable the media control on your control center. And then the third one, which is going to be for the button text. So if you want to enable that or you want to disable that the way you like, make sure after you're done from those to resupring your device so your device will be take the effect and you'll be change everything in your control center there you go guys make sure to give it a try if you like to that we called cc vertical all right and then next what i have for you guys cc status and then once you download the tweak that tweak is going to be providing you if you want to customize some status toggles on your control center and i'm going to be showing you guys how you can do that under the settings Okay, so under the settings here, as you guys can see, once you open the settings for this week, here is going to be providing you each one individual, one of the toggles that you have in your control center. So you can customize that. You can put the text that you want to enable the text or disable the text, and then you can add the anything that you like to add. For example, mine here, the Wi-Fi, the enable text that I have and the disable text, I have just on and off. I just want to show you guys in a video how you can add that and how is that going to be looks like after you customize the things using the tweak here. So after you're done from everything, you need to just make sure to hit the save and respring and your device will be take that effect. So I'm going to be get back to you guys once the device complete uh, respring. All right, so we finish everything right now. And then as you guys can see, you have the toggles on your control center. So what you need to do, just press on one of these here. And then as you guys can see, this is the text that I already add to my enable and disable. So if I turn that off, it will be showing me it's off right now. If I want to open my Bluetooth here, it says it's on. And then once you turn that, it says it's off. The same thing with my airplane mode and my Wi-Fi. So this is what the tweak pretty much is going to be providing you with. Well, I do like it. It's really beautiful if you want to set it on your iDevice. Highly recommend you guys to give it a try if you guys like that kind of stuff in your control center. There you go, guys. CC status. Okay, next what I have for you guys, it's WhatsApp status volume and that tweak what is going to be providing you with is going to be providing you with a small toggle looks like a WhatsApp toggle for your volume button and I'm going to be showing you guys how is that looks like. So if you guys want to see how is that looks like you can see it right now. This is how it looks like so you can turn it up down the way you like and then you can customize the color the background color of the toggle and even for your volume so i'm going to be showing you guys how you can set that right now okay so under the settings when you download the tweak the first thing you need to enable the button here and then you have another toggle you can turn that on or off if you want to use that toggle on your lux queen so here if we scroll down a little bit you guys can see sliders those sliders is going to be customized the toggle that you have on this tweak here so the first one here as you guys can see this is the hood so you can dismiss the delay here so you can put it the way you like and in the volume uh, steps uh, content here and then you have the positions so you can just set it on your left on your right corner and then the other one which is going to be the height so you can set it on the uh, the top here or on the bottom the way you like here as I told you guys, you can customize some colors using the tweak here. So you can choose the volume line color. So simply just click on it. And then after that, you can just set the color that you like. And then you can get back here, choose the background of the color. The same thing, choose the background of the color, set it. And then after you're done, just get back here. And then you have the icon follow line color. So you can enable that or disable that the way you like. And some other stuff that you see here. 
So this is what the tweak pretty much is going to be providing you with. And once you use your volume bone, it's going to be providing you with that small toggle on your lock or home screen. If you want to give it a try, the tweak called WhatsApp status volume. The next tweak that I have for you guys, which is going to be called the battery banner. And I think the name just explained himself. So once you tap on your status bar, whenever you want to activate that, tweak is going to be providing you with a banner on your home screen to providing you with a battery percentage or how, how much you have left once you play a game once you watch your movie once you listen for your favorite song so this is what this tweak is going to be providing you with a banner with a battery percentage and it's going to be disappeared after like couple seconds if you want to configure the tweak you need to download the activator and then from the activator you can just set it the way you like i set it just double tap on my status bar here so once i double tap on my status bar it's gonna be work just like so highly recommend you guys to give it a try really nice and beautiful tweak to set it on your i device there you go guys battery banners the next tweak that I have for you guys, which is going to be called tap to open. And what is that tweak is going to be providing you with? It's going to be switch the swip on your lock screen once you want to open your notification center with just one tap. And I'm going to be showing you guys how to do that. Okay, so this is my lock screen right now here. I'm going to be showing you guys if it's that actually is going to be work. And if I just stop here, as you guys can see, sometimes it's working, sometimes it's not working. So you need to just push on it a little bit hard. Not that much really quick to access the notification. If you want to swipe, like it's pretty much better than the top here. But this is how is the tweak is going to be work pretty much after you download it. Once you download the tweak, the tweak has nothing to configure. It will be work right away once you set it on your iDevice. There you go, guys. Tap to open. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you liked the video please give it a big thumbs up subscribe for my channel for more videos and i see you guys in next video peace